Time for our new feature, Wednesday's Warrior. Chelsea Moriarty came within inches of death in her battle with cancer when she was a child. That's right, she survived her harrowing ordeal, and now the 26-year-old is making the most of her second chance at life. Channel 2's Eric Braid is joining us now with Chelsea and her mother's story, both an amazing story. Yeah, it really is an amazing story. I sat down with Chelsea and her mom just recently and saw quickly how their battle uh, motiva motivated them to become warriors. I was so tired. I just, I wasn't a kid anymore. You just, life stops. 26-year-old Chelsea Moriarty on her life as a 10-year-old battling leukemia. I was really angry. I think the worst thing is I couldn't play anymore. No, it got worse. An allergic reaction to her cancer medication sparked a series of grand mal seizures that almost killed her. Her mom rode with her in the ambulance to the ER. And I had this little window that I could look through and I saw my daughter f just flailing out of control and I was mentally preparing myself that this was probably the night that we would lose her. The seizures left her with brain damage. I couldn't talk, I couldn't brush my teeth. Doctors thought it was permanent. But somehow I slowly got to get better. I learned to talk again, I learned to tie my shoes, I started running and a month Later, when I had my brain scans, they were normal. A miracle? Maybe. She went on to beat cancer, too. But beating such long odds begs the question. Why did I survive? And I still don't have a reason, but I figured it has to be a really good one. There's something important I need to do. And she's doing it. She starts medical school this fall at top-ranked Johns Hopkins University. And oh yeah, she's getting her MBA while she's at it. For medicine, it combines helping people research and teaching, and that's what I love to do. Influenced by her past, but focusing on her future. Cancer was one story of my life, but now I get to write a million more stories. Mom is forged ahead too, keeping busy with work and fundraising. She's personally raised more than $125,000 and counting for blood cancer research, helping to ensure there are more survivors like Chelsea. I have no doubt research saved her life. And research is the only way to ensure that survivor rates get to 100%. Right now, every nine minutes, someone in the United States dies from blood cancer. And another fact, leukemia remains the most common form of cancer and the leading cause of medical death in children. All right, Eric, thank you. We know this is something very important to you. In fact, the Ironman World Championship Triathlon is only 72 days away. Before Eric takes on that challenge, he aims to raise $140,000 for blood cancer research. We have raised so far more than $26,000, but to reach that goal, we're gonna need your help. Donating is easy and so very important. Please go to clicktohouston.com slash team in training to donate.